Hello gamers and welcome back to the channel. All right, so we're gonna get straight into this mission. Very first thing you're gonna do for this quest is go and talk to 801. She will be located in the tower where she always is. Let's go down to her and have a chat. All right, let's see what the quest is. Complete the exotic mission, zero hour. Launch the mission from the Into the Light subscreen on your directory, zero hour completed. Okay, so that's going to be very simple again. Just go into the zero hour mission go and complete it on the normal difficulty. Once you do that, then you will get the next step, right? The next step will tell you then to go back to Ada again, talk to her and uh, it'll start the new quest line, right? The new, the new quest line uh, in typical fashion will be some kind of activity before you actually get to uh you know going into legend in this case is insert siva collection so basically you just gotta kill some things with the outbreak perfected in order to uh start accumulating this right so i found the best place to go to do this was actually in the cosmodrome in the lost sector in the cosmodrome it's gonna be pretty simple just go uh, load up the steps okay once you have done that it's gonna be Really simple, you're just gonna turn around and then start heading back to where you start the game initially, right? It's gonna be the law sector that has the new ramps that lead up to it. Very, very simple place to get to. Just again, just make sure you have Outbreak perfected on as that's the only way you'll be able to earn some of these. Cause you can, you can go in there and other people on your fire team could have it on. But if you don't have it on, you're not going to get any progress because it does count with other people in the fire team. So if you have others with you, just have everybody have Outbreak perfected on. And as long as you guys are getting some nanite kills, it will count. And if you guys ever need help with any of this stuff or, you know, even Pantheon, whatever it may be, we are live almost every single day on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash FableJR. Uh, stop by, you know, let me know you came by from YouTube or if you got like questions anything you know feel free to ask we're, we're always willing to help need help with anything in general you know i'm usually able to help i usually just ask and chat if anybody needs help with anything and if you happen to be there you know we'll take you through again twitch.tv forward slash fable jr you'll stop by and say hi okay so back to the mission here as you can see uh this lost sector like i said we found really easy to get everything done here and if you know, you don't happen to get all of it done. It's as simple as just going all the way back to the entrance, waiting for the load screen to pop back up, and then running right back in to finish it off. It, like I said, it didn't take long at all. We were in and out. I was able to get it all done basically in one one run of the lost sector. You see, uh, you'll see. Like I'll show myself running back in and out. It was just to uh, get. I think it was like one more kill. That I was off. So again, this locked lost sector right here I found to be one of the uh best place to get the stuff. Next part of the quest just asks you to hit the two switches in the exotic mission. Again, uh I'll show you exactly where the switches are, but before that, uh there's also some other stuff you can do, so make sure you just run past uh, all this stuff here, and when you get to this very first room here, right? make sure you clear out all the ads after you do you're going to come back to this a panel this panel here will tell you in what sequence you have to start shooting some of the things in the room in three locations so you just got to make sure you're matching the right ones there's a one location there another one on the pillar and then there's a third one on the wall there once you get all three of those just make sure that the sequence has been accepted and if it has you know then you did it correctly next you're going to head over to the room with all the switches okay so the middle switch is the one that you will need to activate so in order to do so you got to make sure you open up the correct hatch okay so the correct hatch will be that one that i just shot at you're gonna jump over to it activate it and then you're gonna make your way back up so you'll see me do it here so it's not it's not through this hallway here but it's right underneath you're gonna see underneath there's gonna be a 
a little gap down there. You're gonna jump through there. You're gonna go back to where the hatch has opened. You're gonna make your way back up there. This part's gonna require a little bit of like speed. Uh, so just make sure you're moving kind of quick. I mean, you get you do get plenty of time, so don't worry about like you know. Oh, I gotta bring a sword or anything like that. It's, no, it's not nothing like that. It's just gonna require a little bit of speed. But the switch is actually located on the wall here so it could be really easy to miss so make sure you don't miss it because i i did run past it a couple times uh doing some stuff before <laughs> there it is on the wall so make sure once you grab that the timer will start as you see it's about 30 seconds so you have plenty of time so just jump back down you're gonna go basically the same way you went before so you're gonna then jump to the centerpiece there and activate it and that will then trigger the next step the next step is very simple finish out the rest of the mission on legend difficulty if you're having trouble with this maze it is a little different so just look at this pattern here and that that is how you get past uh, this part here if you're doing it on legend all right, now for the rest of the uh, centric perks. So you're just going to run in here. You're going to grab right first, then left. You're going to run out. Get the panel outside. Start on the back left, back right. Run out, and then you're going to run all the way to the right side panel to activate it. That there will give you your centric perk there. That uh, you will need for this gun. As you'll see it here, it's going to pop up as soon as he hits the switch. That is the, the order you want to do it in. Okay, so again, now after this, you just got to go finish out the mission right, on Legend. After you do, the next quest will pop up, and that one will just tell you to go talk to Ada. Once you do, you turn it in. She will then give you the uh, rapid hit, uh, the rapid hit perk which I think is probably one of the best perks you can have on this gun personally. But that is it. That is it for this week. Uh, we'll be back next week for the rest of the quests to so continue to unlock the perks for the Outbreak Perfected. Again, thank you all very much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe and please leave some comments below if you have any questions or anything like that and just drop by the Twitch if you're able to. Again, thank you very much, everybody, and we'll catch you on the next video.